गाइस दिस इज नेगा वर्मा वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल सो इन टूडेज ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न हाउ टू डिज़ाइन दिस प्रोडक्ट पाउच पैकेजिंग इन कॉरल रो सो विदाउट एनी डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो दिस इज द साइज ऑफ आर प्रोडक्ट पाउच पैकेजिंग नाउ फर्स्ट वी विल सिलेक्ट द रेक्टेंगल टूल एंड वी विल ड्रॉ आर रेक्टेंगल नाउ वी विल सेट द साइज ऑफ द रेक्टेंगल 2300 by 3500 pixels now we will set the align of the rectangle first we will click on specified point then align center horizontally and align center vertically now we'll select the rectangle and we will drag like this then right click to make a copy Now we'll right click and we will select convert to curves. Now we'll select the shape tool from the toolbar and we will drag the node. Now we'll click on the center of the line. Now we'll select convert to curve. Now we'll click on the line and we will drag like this. Now we will adjust the shape. Now we'll adjust the size. Now we'll select and we will drag like this. Then right click to make a copy. Now again we will select the shape tool and we will drag the node like this. Now we will adjust with the handles. Now we'll select the rectangle and we will fill color. Now we'll select the shape. and we will fill color now we'll select now we'll select the interactive fill tool then we will select fountain fill now we will set the colors now we'll adjust the fountain fill now we'll select all the shapes and we will remove the outline by right click now we'll select the star tool from the toolbar now with the control key we will draw a star shape now we will set the points 20 and we will set the sharpness 6 now we'll right click on this shape and we will select convert to curves now we'll select the shape tool now we'll select all the nodes and we will select convert to curve Now we'll select symmetrical node. Now we have this shape. I'll we'll place this. Now we'll decrease the size. Now we'll select with the shape and we'll press it to align center. Now we'll adjust. Now we'll fill white color. Now we'll drag inside with the shift. key then we will right click to make a copy now we'll change the color now again we will make one more copy with the shift key we will drag and we will right click now we'll change the color now we'll select all and we will remove the outline now we have all these details and images now we we'll place this first we will select this image now we'll increase the size of the image we will adjust the size according to the shape now we'll select the transparency tool from the toolbar now we will increase the transparency we will keep the transparency 65 now we'll right click on this image we will select power clip inside now we'll click on this rectangle now we'll click on edit now we'll adjust the image I'll click on finish Now we'll select this dry fruit image 
now we'll increase the size I will select with the rectangle and we will press C to align center now we'll place these details first we will place the brand name we will change the color I will select with the shape and we will press C to align center you can see the font style now we will adjust the size of the text I will change the color place this text you can see the font style now we will increase the size of the text now we will change the color Now we will select the contour tool from the toolbar and we will apply on the text. We will drag outside like this. Now we will right click and we will select break contour apart. Or you can just press control key. Now we will change the color. Now we will give a white color. Now I'll place this text and we will give a white color. Now I'll place this text. Again you can see the font style. Now we'll place this on the bottom. We will give a white color. Now we'll select the inner text. And we will select the shadow tool from the toolbar and we will apply like this. Now we will select the rectangle tool. Now we will make a vegetarian sign. We will draw a square. Now we'll fill white color and we will remove the outline. Now we'll drag inside with the shift key. Then right click to make a copy. Now we'll change the color. Now we'll use green color. Now again. We will make one more copy. And we will fill white color. Now we'll select the ellipse tool from the toolbar. And we will draw a small circle on the center. Now we'll fill green color and we will remove the outline now we will select all and we will group now we will adjust the size now we will select this shape and we will give a outline color so guys our product pouch packaging design for dry fruits is ready I hope you like the design. If you have any question regarding this tutorial, you can ask me in the comment box. Please like, share and comment. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos. 
थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग